Hey guys, and welcome to the next episode of Q&A, the video where you ask the questions and I try my best to answer them. This is Q&A 16, and I've picked five random questions from five random subscribers, and I will be trying my best to answer them today. So if you find yourself enjoying this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. Also, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments down below, and maybe they'll make it into Q&A 17. But without further ado, let's dive right in. Our first question for today is from Gigazilla23, and the question is, are you planning to do an animation movie or video? That is a really good question. Actually, I have thought of doing an animation video or film, and in a way, the Thomas and the Multiverse movies do count as animation, but I really don't know the first thing about like animation, like making things move and whatnot, and, but I've always wanted to do it. it. It sounds really fun. I mean, it does sound hard and time consuming, but I, I feel like it does sound a lot of fun, and I, I'd like to maybe take animation school at some point, maybe, I don't know and maybe I could take some animation classes and hopefully it'll help improve my editing skills so then I can make more videos on YouTube and um, make better quality videos. So yeah, maybe. I, I do plan on making animation at some point. Maybe take maybe taking like an animation class or something. I don't know, maybe. But that was a really good question. Thank you for that. Question two is from Anti-Maximal06, and the question is, have you planned on becoming a paleontologist for a career? I mean, I do love paleontology, like dinosaurs and prehistoric mammals and anything before the dinosaurs and whatnot, and digging up fossils does sound like a lot of fun. I would have to travel abroad, like I would have to travel around the world looking for dinosaur fossils, and... It would be fun, you know, but I don't really see it as my as my end game career, if you know what I'm saying. Maybe when I was a kid I wanted to do it, but now I guess I don't know. Digging up fossils, hmm, maybe maybe it might be fun, I don't know. But yeah, that that was a good question too. Thank you for that. Question 3 is from Jamie Dormer, and the question is have you ever thought of doing an anger rant on All Engines Go? I mean, I kind of already did it in a previous q and I think it was the second one I did. If I were to do a rant, what else could I add to the table that another YouTuber hasn't said? I could share in my own words on my thoughts on it, but I'd probably just be beating a dead horse by that point. So I'm not really sure. If I do, maybe on the Unique Guy 24 channel, I kind of do have some things to say about it though, so maybe later on on the Unique Guy 24 channel I might upload it on that, because I tend to post my Thomas content on there now. I don't know. I haven't really uploaded on there that often because I've been uploading on this channel and my new channel, Giganato Gaming, but if I do a rant it'll probably be on the Unique Guy 24 channel. I might do it because I do have some things to say about it. So yeah. There's that. I, I do have things to say about All Engines Go, though. But I'll do that in a separate video. Question four is from Chucky Ben, and the question is, would you rather watch Jurassic World Dominion or Godzilla vs. Kong? Easily Godzilla vs. Kong, because it's way better, it has a lot more action, and the final battle is a lot more action-packed than Dominion's final battle. I, I keep saying this, I know, but Dominion's final battle is a total let down. It was a total let down, and I feel like I, I expected a lot more from it. I guess it is what it is, right? And that's why I made my own version of Jurassic World Dominion on my YouTube channel. If you haven't watched it, I suggest you do. I will leave a link of the video in the description down below. So yeah, Godzilla vs. Kong is easily better. Our final question for today is from Goldilocks, and the question is, what is your favorite scene from Puss in Boots, The Last Wish? God, there was a lot of them. I do like a lot of the scary scenes, like any scene with death in it gives me the chills. Jack Horner is absolutely hilarious, and so is Perito. Goldilocks has a cool story, too. Like, I actually felt bad for her. I actually wanted her to find that family, but 
it turns out she had it all along in the three bears, you know? And, and I thought that was pretty wholesome. But my absolute favorite scene is when Goldilocks and Baby Bear go off on each other. And then Perito just roasts the both of them. I absolutely love that. Perito starts swearing and cussing and oh my god. That was such a funny scene. I died laughing in the theater. Like, my god. That was, that was a really funny scene. But yeah, my favorite scene is when Perito gets captured by Goldilocks and the Three Bears. That's just me, though. And now that we've got the questions out of the way, the question of the month is, what is the funniest April Fool's prank you ever pulled? With me, a lot of my pranks are pretty tame compared to some of the pranks I would see on YouTube and whatnot. But yeah, I, I really can't remember what pranks I pulled, like, on the, um, on the spot, so... Let me know in the comments down below what pranks you thought were the funniest you ever pulled. And that's going to have to wrap it up for this Q&A. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. Also, let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below, and maybe they'll make it into Q&A 17. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. So long!